Hi, I'm Todd Wiley, a third generation pork producer from Walker, Iowa. Welcome to our family farm. Pork producers are the original recyclers and the fact that uh, we make manure but we also utilize that manure in our next year's crop. Uh, we grow the corn and the soybeans. Uh, we utilize the corn in our feed rations to feed our pigs back. Uh, consequently then the pigs create more manure that we can utilize for the next year. We choose to hire a third party to come in and haul our manure for us. Uh, they're specialized in what they do. They have the right equipment. They have the right training. Uh, they're just more capable of doing it. And uh, our labor situation is such that we don't have three or four guys available to do a job like that because it is a big job. And so if they come in and take care of it uh, in a matter of, of a day or two, that's uh, more appropriate for our labor situation and, and what we have available to us. In our case, we do this process twice a year, once in the spring before the crop is planted and once in the fall. And ideally, we'd like to do it just once a year but uh, we have some manure pits that uh, don't lend themselves to that. We need to move manure more often so we have the capacity uh, to store the manure uh, so that it doesn't become a pollutant or a problem somewhere else. At our south farm, they utilize a drag line system, which is actually an umbilical cord or a hose that they pull behind an applicator. And there's a pump at the south site where the manure is pumped through, uh, through the hose to the applicator, which is out in the field, and that actually pulls the manure on underground into the field uh, so that it's available for the crop. There are certain nutrients within the manure, including nitrogen predominantly, that is beneficial for specifically the corn crop because corn is a, a nitrogen using crop and we must supply nitrogen to it, whether it's in the form of manure or in the form of a synthetic fertilizer. And generally, we do add additional nitrogen and additional uh, fertilizer to the crop ground because the nutrient density within sow manure from our farm is uh, such that, that we can't completely meet our needs with that manure. The differences between uh, the crops that have the benefit of manure application versus synthetic fertilizers generally is there is a yield bump from the manure ap applied ground. Even in a case where we're applying uh, manure to ground that will be soybeans in the subsequent year, we see soybeans actually outperform uh, their neighbor beans from that manure application. I think the biggest thing that, that they do in, a, in terms of applying the manure is to actually knife, knife it into the soil so it's not surface applied. Manure that is surface applied generally has a, a fairly uh, abrasive odor to it and is also more prone to be washed into ditches and streams and we sure aren't interested in having that happen.